Um, hello? Is Sheila Walker in, please? Uh, this is Pat calling. She's not, but she told me she was working late tonight. She took the afternoon off? Uh, no, no thank you. No message. Damn. Women are all the same. <laughs> Never trust <laughs> She's out with another guy, so help me, I'm gonna kill her. Uh, who is it? Uh, Mr. Rush, uh, Jackie's father. Oh, just a second. Hello. How are you doing, Mr. Rush? I'm Pat. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you. <laughs> Whoa, Monroe said you were beautiful. He wasn't exaggerating. Why, thank you. Uh, look, um, I'm sorry all this business with Monroe got out of hand. Let, let, let me try to explain. Oh, Mr. Rush, you don't know what he's been putting me through. Like today, he sent a giant birthday cake to me at Balaban's. Scared the life out of half the models in the showroom. How? He was in it. <laughs> I've explained to him in no uncertain terms that I'm not interested in him, but he's Relentless. He keeps calling, writing, sending me flowers, candy, parakeets. Parakeets? <laughs> and I'm allergic. I've broken out in hives all over my body. Just look. Uh, I, I, I don't even... I'm telling you, that man is driving me crazy. <laughs> well, I... I'm afraid I'm partly to blame. I... I didn't realize I gave Monroe such bad advice. I, I feel terrible. You feel terrible. I haven't had a good night's sleep in over a week. My back is killing me. <laughs> well, you just relax and forget about Monroe. I'll, I'll convince him that he's not right for you, that this whole infatuation is a waste of time and, and emotions. Uh, it was nice meeting you. Oh. Mr. Rush, you don't know how much this means to me. This job is so important to me, and, and, and I have to make good. Yeah, there, everything's going to be fine. If I don't get Monroe out of my life, I swear I'm going to have a, a nervous breakdown. <laughs> I-I-I-I-I-I can explain. Well, you'd better explain. Uh, I, my name isn't Patricia. It, it's really Patrick. I can see that. Go on. Uh, uh, Patricia's really my sister. She's a fashion designer in New oh, York. Oh, I see. And as a young child, you were her dress dummy. You never got over it. No. <laughs> um, um, I wanted to be a designer, too, but I couldn't get a break. You don't know how close you are to getting one. No, wait a minute. Anyway, Patricia got married a couple of months ago, and she gave up designing. So I figured, well, that it could be it for me. How? Oh. Well, Balaban's needed a woman designer from New York. So I... I borrowed my sister's identity. And her wardrobe. Yeah, you got it. Let me tell you, her shoes are killing me. Does Jackie know about this? Oh, no way. She and I work together. If they catch on, they'll think she's in on it and she'll get fired. Thanks again, Mom. I'll send Dad right up. Jackie. All right, put on that wig. Put on those shoes. Dad, Pat, are you in there? Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> We're fine. We're just sitting here talking. I'll be right there. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Put on those shoes. Dad? Hurry, hurry. Damn it, my feet swell. I can't get them back on. Uh, I'll help you with the shoes. What's going on in there? Nothing, nothing. Don't be so impatient. You're breaking my toes. Forget about your toes. We gotta get these shoes on. Hi. What are you doing out here in the hallway? Oh, Sarah, hi. I'm waiting for Dad to open the door. It's locked. Oh, I have my key. <gasps> Push. <laughs> what are you two doing? Now, what does it look like? I'm teaching her karate. 
I mean, just in case Monroe should come by here and try to get fresh with her. Hell, hell, hing. <laughs> Why was the door locked? Uh, 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 Monroe, in case Monroe shows up. Uh, very good. I mean, yes, that's right. <laughs> right. Oh, hi, I'm Sarah, Jackie's sister. Jackie's told me so much about you. You have a dynamite body. <laughs> okay, that's enough. You've met. Your father's been very sweet. He's going to talk to Monroe tomorrow. Oh, thanks, Dad. <laughs> you know, Monroe's probably waiting for you at your place. You better spend the night here with us. Ah, uh -huh. what do you what do you mean? She can't spend the night here. Why not? Because, uh, because, uh, well, because the couch is uncomfortable. She's got a bad back. No problem. She can sleep with me. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> <You're right. laughs> The couch, the couch, the couch is fine. <laughs> I mean, it is new, and it is comfortable, and it is good for your back. You will sleep on the couch tonight. It's better than starving in New York, you understand. I understand. <laughs> of course. Okay, everybody, give me a hand here. Let's put this together.